Stop, stop, stop. What's good, what's poppin' and welcome to this reaction video and you guys, the time has finally come. This man has finally released more solo music. And I'm so excited because I know he's releasing an album or an EP because he's going on tour. And I just so happen to be going to one of his shows on tour. So I'm super excited, nonetheless. Today we are reacting to BM's brand new song, Nectar, featuring Jay Park. Ladies and gentlemen, I can only imagine what this is gonna be. Actually, I can't imagine. I actually have no clue, no thoughts whatsoever. All I know is I'm super excited, so I don't wanna yap too much. Let's hop right into this video. I'm gonna assume this song is potentially fully in English because there is no subtitles, but we'll see. <sighs> that man is so beautiful. And also y'all, he's really tall. Like, ex like, ex like Jesus Christ break my neck tall. Stop, stop, stop. Oh, I love this sound. Mm. His voice is just like it's piercing. It's so like ooh, it's just so deep. Ooh. I love that his sound has like a Latin feel to it. Like the beats that he uses, they all kind of have a Latin feel, but his voice is very like R and B. I love the combo. Hey, 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 hey. Take it down, down, make it spread Yeah, I'm gonna be for real. I think some people forget Jay Park actually got vocals sometimes. Mm. Dude. Dude. You're telling me I'm probably about to see this song live? Someone's gonna have to hold me up. <laughs> Dude, it's funny because this song makes me just, it just wants to make me wind my hips, but like twerk at the same time, and I just feel like it's not that vibe. It's a wind your hip vibe, but not like a twerk vibe. But it's good regardless. That was a, that was crazy. Ooh, look at the footwork, dude. Oh my god. Dude, I just, you know what? People need to stop being so freaking talented, okay? People need to stop it, okay? You're making me feel bad. <laughs> You're making me feel like I'm nothing. I'm kidding. Here's the thing with this man right here. I have seen snippets of this man talking about tour. And I don't know if you guys know, but this tour is 21 plus. Do you know how scared I am to go to this thing? <laughs> and I mean scared as in like, am I going to be okay after? Genuinely, like, am I going to, I think I'm like going to have an 
I don't know. I think I'm going to have a panic attack at this show. Genuinely. The way that I've seen this man talk about, like, I saw he did an interview. I think it was with Joan. I think he did a podcast. And she asked him, like, oh, like, why did you make the, like, concert show, like, 20, 21 plus? Like, you know, what's the whole reason? And he's like, come and find out. Now I'm scared to come, sir. But I've already, pause. But I've already. <laughs> but I've already paid for my ticket so obviously I'm going to the show and I'm super excited and by the time I'm reacting to this I have a week literally a week and a day until this show so I'm going to try to make sure this is posted before I go um so that way you guys know that by the time this is posted I am probably freaking out inside but I actually saw him perform um when I went to card their tour playground they actually came to my hometown they came to Louisville Eh, L's up represent they were the first group that I got to see perform in my hometown and it was so special to me because I genuinely like there's normally not a lot of k-pop groups there's rarely any that come to Louisville I think Card's done it um One Us has done it Perp Kiss I think did it Vivis is coming to Louisville which if I go to KCON, I'm not going to be able to see them, which kind of makes me sad because um, it's within those dates. And when I saw that card was coming, I lost my mind. I was like, there's no way I cannot go to this show. I showed up to work late just so I could go to this show because I was I like refused to miss it. And it was one of the best shows ever. One of my one of my best nights I've ever had genuinely felt like a party. Let me put it this way. If people knew how to act and they just made this show like a party type of vibe it would have been insane because that's what it already felt like but obviously it was like a party in everyone's seats but like if everyone had like freedom oh like it would have been an insane insane experience one thing i really like about bm is his sound for himself i think his voice very much obviously suits him um but i like how he has this deep it's not even raspy you know what i mean like it's just deep and i love because it's not just his music but card as a whole i like how they kind of have the whole like latin caribbean type of sound for their music um because no other k-pop really does that i think that's what really makes them unique and why i love them so much because it's a different sound that i can i'm only ever going to really hear from them and if any groups have done it please correct me but as far as i know like card and bm obviously as a solo artist like they're the only ones who really i feel like stick to that type of vibe and i thoroughly love that because even bm's last release low key dude 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 low key you're telling me i'm also gonna see that on tour dude 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 someone's actually gonna have to help me next week <sighs> you guys i thoroughly enjoyed i love the jay park feature i like that he kind of showcased his vocals more than like rap because you know everyone does know jay park is like the rapper he did the song moment man everyone loves it and goes crazy whenever he performs it but i feel like people really forget like jake park also does like have vocals and i like that he kind of showcased that more and this song for this feature um with bm and i think these two are actually really 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 good combo i would love to see choreography like full choreography for this um song because based off of the little snippets we got in the music video it looks like it goes hard and that's something that i really want to applaud bm for because a lot of the times when you're taller and your limbs are longer it's a lot harder to dance but bm has a swag to him as well and a style that is like perfect for dance and it's like he knows how to move his body which i do know because he's talked about it on like podcasts and everything um because i used to well not used to i still listen to it but when he's on get real he talks about how he did like dance a dance club in school and everything and he was like a dancer growing up so he's always had that vibe and swag and he's always danced and learned how to dance so you know it i feel like at this point it does come to him naturally but to see him kind of show that with his own music like his style of dance and everything everything and how he does it and how he portrays himself when he dances Mwah. like genuinely love to see it so i'm super super excited to go to his concert this just kind of like this is like a little taste of what i'm about to witness next week and i'm super excited god i really like i'm actually speechless if i had to give the song a rating i'm giving it a 10 out of 10 i've reacted to a bunch of songs today and I think I've only given three different things a 10 out of 10. One was Nikki's Artist of the Month performance. 
the second was 17th La La Lee and now BM's Song Nectar. Those three are my top, top reaction watches today like genuinely all of them are so good and so i'm super excited to see bm um live and in stereo for the second time ah, like i'm so excited y'all don't even understand so that is all for this reaction video i hope you enjoyed if you did you can like comment subscribe comment down below what you thought of bm's release did you like it did you not like it what's your favorite part what's your least favorite part the whole shebang let's have a little chat in the comments below you can follow all my socials they'll be linked in the description box below do whatever you want to do and i'll see you when i see you bye